Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum. My name is Intan Nusyabika. Today, I would like to do the demonstration for the simulation of my FYP project, which is to, the, to design the microstrip parallel couple band pass meter at 2.4 GHz. Here, I will show you how this design is produced by using CSD software. <coughs> So the substrate which I use is FR4 with the electric of 4.4. So I will show you how to start the design to start the start design the substrate. First I need to click the local WCS. Then I need to click the big icon. This is the big icon. After that I will set the dimension of the substrate. So this shows the task to define the dimension of the brick. Okay, you can see that. Then weight and the thickness for the substrate. Okay, uh, the material here we can change to the desired material. So I will use the FR4 material. So then I using the same step. I will design the ground of the subject by using copper with thickness of 0.0035 mm and for all the strip line I use uh, sub, uh, copper with the same thickness which is 0.0035 mm but different length and different length width and spacing then after the design is completed I will Set the port impedance, uh, which I use is the wave guide port at input and output with 50 ohm of reference impedance. So, after my design is finished, I will start the simulation, and this will simulate my result of filter. So after my Z is muted, I will focus on the 1D result which is S1 meter or S11 and S21. So uh, we can see that uh, firstly the center frequency that I got is 2.3 GHz which the return loss is S11 is achieved at 9045.573 dB and its insertion loss S1 is 84.6. TB. So the written loss I got is uh, less than the the value and high insertion high loss. Next, I will show you the effect of weight, length, and spacing of couple line on filter frequency. Uh, the dimension of the slip line is changed following the desired value. First, this is the result of changing the length of the slip line. So we can see that uh, when the the length of the slip line is decreased, the resonant frequency will increase with insertion loss and the better loss parameters are more or less unchanged. Next, you can see the effect changing spacing of slip line to the filter frequency. And I have changed the spacing of S1 and S2. I increased the space of S1 and S2. And we can see the resonant frequency has decreased. And the return loss has increased to negative 9.8 from negative 45.3 dB, which better than negative 10 dB. And then lastly, we see the effect of weight to the filter frequency. Okay, when the weight of the strip line increases, the resonant frequency is decreased, and we see the insertion loss of the filter is negative 3.9 and the return loss, return loss is negative 26.6 that's all for me thank you for your attention Assalamualaikum